In this lecture, we'll take a look at how to create a single page application project using ASP.NET Core and React. So the first thing that we'll do is open up Visual Studio 2019, click on continue, click on create a new project. And once you do that, you'll see this window coming up. Here you need to select this ASP.NET Core application. And once you have done that, you need to select this one, ASP.NET Core Web Application. Here you can see it provides templates for single page applications using Angular, React, or React plus Redux. Now just click Next and choose a directory where you want to have this application created. I'll be putting it over here and uh, the name of the project will be SPA that is single page application. Let's go ahead and click on create now. Once you do that, you'll be asked to choose the template so here we'll be creating a project template for creating ASP.NET Core application with React.js. This is what we'll be selecting. And then we'll click on Create. And this is going to scaffold a new project for us. And here you can see it has created the application. Let's go ahead and uh, try running it once the restoration has been completed. As you can see over here, restore completed in 7.16 seconds. And uh, let's go ahead and try running it on IES Express. And here you can see the application is up and running now. Now let's go ahead and uh, try creating a similar application, but this time we'll be creating it using the command line interface. In order to work with the command line interface, you first need to launch the command prompt like I've done over here. You can just go ahead and type cmd to launch the command prompt. Once you have done that, you need to go into the directory where you want to create the application. For instance, in my case, it's this directory spa, and I'm inside that directory now. What you can do is you can type .NET new in order to find out what are the templates available and their short names and the languages as well. So here, as you can see, we have already created one using ASP.NET Core with React.js. In case you wanted to create it using command line interface, you would have done something of this sort, .NET new and then the short name React. Make sure that you specify space. So it's .NET new and then the short name. Using this, you can create a new project inside the directory and then you can obviously open it up in uh, Visual Studio 2019 like we have done over here. In case you don't have Visual Studio 2019, 2017, you can also make use of Visual Studio code. And uh, there you'll have to ensure that you have the .NET Core installed and using the command line interface in Visual Studio code editor, you can create a single page application project. But I would recommend you to install either 2019 or Visual Studio 2017.